to put her in the number three spot here in this opening round. We bring in Megan Oldham coming off of a big air silver performance yesterday. Megan has been looking strong all week, skiing with such confidence. Well, front side switch up on that rail. Coming in switch. Switch 270 on the flat down. We're seeing a couple women opting for that line choice. A right side a nice reach right back side for 900 reaching for back for the tail into the switch 900. Landing solid and into the money booter. Going for the double cork, 1260, what? nailing Huge. it, and she went oh, massive, goodness, taking that to the bottom of the, the landing. Moon, Woo! Yeah, nice. Solid run from Megan. Coming into X Games Aspen 2022, a three-time medalist. She added another one to make it four total, but let's take another look at her first run on the Jeep Slope style course. Here's that switch nine, letting go of the grab a little early if I had to be critical, and unfortunately, the judges have to be critical. And here is the double cork 12, getting the safety grab, holding it throughout, and landing one, two, three lines down on that landing, going absolutely massive. Yeah, she's you hope it's just a technical issue and that she's uh, not injured, but uh, we will get an update to you as soon as we get it. But that is the big story shaking down here in the second round with a little over 14 minutes left to go. Megan Oldham just got bumped down into that number four position. Can she counter back here? Such a strong field out here today. Switch up there to 270 off that second rail feature. Clean through the rails so far. Switch 270, and coming into the jumps where she really shines. The right side, right side 900, 900, tail grab, tail grab nice landing beautifully, landing. plenty of speed. And there is the switch 900, getting the safety grab in there, not holding it quite as thoroughly. And here is the double cork 12, oof. Just getting over the knuckle there. Gonna have to see if that is an improvement. I would say that bottom jump, this double cork 12, is not quite as good as what we saw in run number one, but we'll have to see if there were enough other improvements to offset it. My guess is not. You make such a statement with this last jump, and as much as judges try to be objective, sometimes there is a little bit of subjectivity in terms of just the emotional response you have to it. The same names in the top three spots here. They just flip-flop here from second to third. We bring in Megan Oldham, who now sits in that number five slot here with 4.37 and count down to go. That was a look at a front swap. So we saw Maggie doing the blind swap where you are rotating up towards the top of the hill. And Megan opting for the front swap, rotating toward the bottom of the hill. Clean so far, nice 900 on that first jump. Switch left seven, going huge. Almost looked like she wanted to set up for a switch dub there. I could be wrong about that, but she came in hot. Just calling it off there on that last hit. Gonna regroup and take it back up to the top here for the next round. And there is a look at that. Yeah, it looks like she was maybe going for a double and got a little hooked up on that takeoff. Manages to find the ground again and can drag and washes out. One more go at Style course, Megan Oldham is the last one that can shake up the standings. She sits on the outside looking in by two spots. It all comes down to this last run. I mean, Tess can't even watch right now. So many nerves, totally out of her control. Beautiful switch up to 270 out on that second rail feature. Switch two, coming into the jumps. The right cork nine tail grab. You could hear a pin drop right now. The anticipation going for the switch double nine. We have not seen that out of Megan yet. And the dub 12. Oh, and she lands it. Oh my gosh. Wow. Okay. Hold on, everybody. That 
That is crazy. She also just did two doubles in one run. Both her and Matilde did two doubles in one run. Were her rails strong enough to overtake Tess Ledeau? Only time will tell. Locking the safety grab there, spotting the landing. Here is that dub 12 again. Going so big, speed not an issue for Megan at all. That is some phenomenal speed. Nice is this going Whoa. to be enough? Everyone nervously eyeing that leaderboard. It is going to be enough to get her into the podium. It's not enough.